Hey guys, what's going on? So, <clears throat> one, it's really cold. It is so blinking cold. Uh, but if I turn on the heater, you can't hear me. So we're gonna run over this real quick. Uh, I've been working on my front grill here. So what we have here is the limited um, body match grill. And uh, I'm gonna be doing a little bit of modification to this piece in order to fit this piece. All right, so I already played around with the letters a little bit, but I'm not sure if I'm going to keep that or not. So uh, if you notice, I don't know if I can really show this off too much, but if you see one's taller than the other, all right, and um, so you have to do a little bit of work to make the center portion on this fit into that uh, grill. So this is what we're going to do all right so <clears throat> when you're cutting everything out everything inside here of course has to get cut out as for the support and everything like that um, now what i'm doing that's a little bit different because i have an armored bumper on the front of my truck is i'm going to be keeping the portion that fits that would be too tall for the other one because I have that um, north uh, northwest trail, um, I have the front grill. Basically, it's a, it's an open top grill, so uh, there's there's a lot of space down below. I like to kind of fill it up, maybe maybe uh, make it look a little bit better, and uh, just see if I can pull it off. So uh, what we're going to be needing for this project, some short hair bondo hardener to go with that. All right. And then you need your uh, handy dandy Dremel of 10,000 different brands, whichever one works for you is great. And then we're going to need, uh, well, I got the cheapo cutting kit because it's only plastic. So we're not doing anything really fancy, um, but we're going to be cutting it all out. And then we're going to be epoxying it back in. And I'm looking for my epoxy. And my epoxy. Huh. Where is my epoxy? Anyway, uh, so the epoxy is plastic specific. Uh, JB Weld makes it. I like their stuff. Um, so that's what we'll be using on that. <clears throat> and I think we're good here. Let's get the cut.
All right, so I'm starting to do the plastic balding. Um, Got to heat up the base uh, plastic first. So everything here is ABS plastic, so we're working with all the same type stuff. It's really smelly, um, but um, unlike normal welding where you have an arc creating that heat to fuse the metals together, um, you've got a wood burner tip. Um, it's kind of more like soldering or brazing I, I would say um, I'm not I'm not a you know a welder of all all fashions so uh, don't take my word for it but then it, the it, it just becomes liquid and you kind of fill in the cracks and you kind of work it this, this way and that but you want to make sure that you keep your base um, heated and you move slow just let the heater work and um, you, you'd be amazed at how clean you can actually make this uh, I've got to go back and fix mine um, because I had some extra vibration and I think some of my repairs to how the grill secures to the uh, to the hood were damaged so but really plastic welding is the way to do this it really is So uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna cut this one off here at, at kind of the 15 minute mark. Thanks for watching. I'm trying to get caught up on all the videos that uh, I need to. So thanks for watching. Appreciate it.